Minnesota Fine Vikings had been hoping to reunite with defensive tackle Diesel Dalvin Tomlinson as he his contract was due to void. Uh, they had pushed back the void date uh, to uh, potentially help the Vikings avoid some 2023 uh, cap pits and potentially uh, rework his deal and reunite for the 2023 season and beyond, but didn't quite work out. As always, in free agency, money talks, and it is what it is. A rap sheet, go. Sources, the Browns are expected to sign a former Vikings defensive tackle, Dalvin Tomlinson, landing their coveted big-time defenders on day one of free agency. He gets a four-year deal with $57 million, with $27.5 million guaranteed. Now, I would have definitely liked uh, Dalvin Tomlinson back, but you know, 14 and a quarter million per year? Mm, nah. Nah, 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 nah. And now the main thing for the Vikings is his uh, $7.5 million dead cap hit uh, does come due in 2023. Uh, if he had been resigned, it would have been able to prorate that out uh, $2.5 million per year over the last three years of the deal, uh, including uh, you know, whatever the, the new cap hits would have been with the new contract. But uh, the Vikings and Kwesi, like I said, he's all about taking uh, cap hits in 2023, hence no extension for Kirk Cousins at, at this moment in time, as well as trying to clear up as much cap as possible for 2024 and you know like i said dalvin thompson he had a good year uh over the last two seasons for the vikings when he's been healthy and he was one of the lone bright spots on the defense uh that was not great at, at times last season and i think that him in the locker room he was a huge leader he was a captain in everything except for having a c on his chest he was a captain back when he was with the giants and he was a guy who's fantastic in the locker room he was good against the run he was underrated as a pass rusher and i think that the browns and uh, you know, Quasey's uh, mentor, Andrew Barry, and former Vikings uh, offensive coordinator, Steph, uh, Kevin Stefanski, uh, get themselves a good one along the defensive line. And for the Vikings D-line depth, uh, it's a little bit of a need. Like, uh, cornerback is a need. Defensive uh, interior is certainly a need. You got Harrison Phillips, who was in the la uh, who's in the second year of his three-year deal, coming over from Buffalo last year. Ross Blacklock, who was traded for uh, from Houston. Uh, Jumping James Lynch, the pride of Baylor. Asazi Otamuo, the second-year guy coming uh, out of the Gophers. Kyrus Tonga was brought back as an exclusive rights free agent. Jonathan Bullard still hanging out there as a free agent. And you got TJ Smith and Sheldon Day. So, uh, the Vikings uh, and their defensive interior uh, with Ryan Flores still bring rocking the three four you know the the four techs the nose tackles the three techs uh, everything man uh it's gonna it's gonna have to be a little bit of a need and as of right now the vikings have lost well if you consider uh dancer a starter which he was at the beginning of the season the vikings have lost four starters uh from their defense last year jordan hicks remains hmm. uh, but they are probably going to lose um, you know, they're probably going to lose uh, Sean on Sullivan uh, as well. TBD, what happens with Harrison Smith? They have, have to make a decision uh, with him sooner rather than later. Zadarius uh, also is probably going to be gone uh, now that they have Marcus Davenport in the building. And who, who, who knows? Who, who knows what's going to happen? But, you know, like I said, would have liked to have had uh, Dalvin Thompson back. But, you know, 14 and a quarter, you know, hats off to him. Go get the bag. Is what it is. Uh, but now, now he offsets in the compensatory pick formula. Uh, him and Marcus Davenport. So uh, there you go. But like, like I said, would like to have him back, but ain't competing with that money. It is what it is. There you go. Anyways, your thoughts and our thoughts. Uh, Vikings lose uh, defensive tackle Dalvin Tomlinson to the Browns. Uh, let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Most worth the work. Put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.